Wayne Kempo is a, it's a martial art that I came up with. I mean, I didn't out of thin air, but I put different things together and I, I cooked it up and called it Hawaiian Kempo. So I put it together uh, and it's a martial art system and curriculum that's, that's a graduating from white belt to black belt. Um, it's a traditional martial art where we have belt ceremonies, we have an instructor, we have a, we have a belt system, um, and we have uh, kids and adult classes. So it's that. And its curriculum includes um, equal parts of striking, wrestling, jujitsu, and physical conditioning, which we call cross pit. So it's a traditional martial art, but it's a non traditional group of techniques. Some people could call it MMA because my original art was Kaju Kempo, which is Karate, Judo, Jiu Jitsu, Kempo, and Boxing. And it's a mixture of martial arts, but I, I shy away from calling it a martial uh, MMA because MMA is a sport. It's a sport. So to call it a martial art, um, MMA, a martial art, does it a disservice. Because when you're in the street and someone attacks you, you're going to come back with Hawaiian Kempo. You're not going to come back with a sport version of it. Now the sport version can be very effective in the street, but it's not made for the street. It's made for a cage or a ring with referee, pads, a mat, you know, a, a corner man, etc. So Hawaiian Kempo takes MMA, the street out of MMA, and turns it into a martial art. And with that, you could go back easily into MMA and, and fight MMA, learning Hawaiian Kempo, but it's made for the street. So the pit is the name of the gym. So wherever you are is the pit. When I'm at the beach and I'm training in Santa Monica, that's the pit. When I'm training in my hotel room, that's the pit. When I'm training at, at you know, this beautiful gym, it's the pit. So the pit is the name of the structure that we train in or we train at. Hawaiian Kempo is what we train. That's our system.